Good afternoon. Wait. Good afternoon. I'm Jay Alexander here with Everything Entertainment and News. Yesterday, the man himself, Kanye West, kicked off his new launch in Paris to the latest season of his clothing brand, Yeezy Season. But it wasn't Mr. West who stole the show, but his six-year-old daughter, Northwest, or as some might say, Northy. Northy killed it with a banger rap performance while her mom, Kim Kardashian, and other Keeping Up With The Kardashian stars, fans, and fa Kanye fans cheered her on. In videos, you can see how truly happy Kanye is seeing his little girl turn into a rock star, just like her dad. Speaking about the Kardashians, North and Kim weren't the only ones in headlines this weekend. Kylie Jenner, Kim's youngest sister, has been making news for multiple reasons. Multiple reasons. One being the rumor that she and rapper Travis Scott are back together and expecting their second child. They had been spotted together after the breakup, and things looked pretty great for the two. Kylie even modeled for his new campaign to promote his Nike and Cactus Jack collab sneakers. Vanessa Bryant's legal team speaks out after the, the reports that alleged that deputies shared photos from Kobe Bryant's helicopter crash. Bryant personally went to the sheriff's office back in January to demand that there will be no photographers and that the officers protect her and her families and the victim's families' privacy. She, she feels that First responders should be trustworthy and not, not capable of leaking such graphic information, especially because it's not their information to leak, and she wanted to keep things private in this time. She lost a daughter and a husband, and to have those people uh, who she's supposed to trust leak this information is disgusting. Vanessa's team has made it clear that the LAFD will be prosecuted to the fullest extent for their lack of human decency, and the individuals will be facing the harshest possible discipline. Lastly, Oprah takes a tumble. Oprah Winfrey, who was given a speech at an event in LA, mid-sentence fell, which has turned into an ongoing meme. The 66-year-old is totally fine and laughed off the fall by saying, pick the wrong shoes. This video has turned into an internet frenzy with tons of celebrities and fans mocking Winfrey for the fall. Many think it's what she deserves after she and her friend, Gail King, decided to bring up Kobe's rape allegations that were proven false just a month after his passing, while his family, friends, and fans are in a time of mourning. That was this week's news update. I'm Jay Alexander. See you next time.